And good evening on what is a perfect night for football. The floodlights shining down on the players as we speak. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And very excited to be bringing you live action from Ligue 1, the top division here in France. It's Stade de Reims versus Marseille. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. When Doozy, they really look after the ball when they have it. Really bright looking attack. And the keeper there to make sure nothing untoward happened. Well, they have the ball once more. Gentusi. But really sticking to the task defensively. Well, we know how troublesome he can be on the pitch, but what should we expect from him today, Stuart? Well, the best players are the ones that can play in tight areas, and he can certainly play in tight areas. He wriggles out of situations, he can find that penetrative pass, and he's such a good player when he gets the ball out of his feet and gets shots away. He could be the outstanding player today. Tremendous block. Foké, Munetsi, oh moving it nicely, good tackle, and the advantage accrues to the attacking side, and a chance to whip it in here, however nothing comes of it. Genghis Under. Chavalera. Kai Sierhuis. And they continue to advance. And a lot of options here. Oh, tight offside decision. But the flag does go up. Well, he's going to be disappointed with that pass. A super tackle and they've won possession. Fayette. And there it is! The breakthrough! That will do nicely! Well, here it is again. He hits this so sweetly, doesn't he? That's a brilliant goal from a top-class player. And the ball moving again. What sort of response will we see from them now? On the back of that particular challenge will the referee let the matter rest there well deemed to have been a cautionable offense well no question about it he deserved his book in there
And the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. Arkadiusz Milik. Well, they're sitting ever deeper. Promising attack, this. And back with Milik. Gives it a go. Well, diving magnificently to make sure he got there. Dimitri Payet with the corner. Well, that's the end of that for now. Fass. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. Well, Dimitri Payet was certainly busy in the first half. Sum up his performance for us. Well, it was certainly a good first 45 minutes for the lad. Obviously, he got his goal. To... As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Arkadiusz Milik. Genghis Under. Matteo Guendouzi. Payet putting his body on the line. Well, nicely cut out. Very quick thinking there. Working really well as a team to regain possession. Bayet. It's a neat move. And he read it really well. Fine save. They've decided that now is the time to go to the bench. Playing it in. Terrific block. Well, as a defender, that will sit you down to the ground. Matteo Guendouzi. He made it look simple, really. Cafaro. Chance to run at them. And he's alone in the middle by the look of things. Well, really fine goalkeeping. Good diving stop. Well, just listen to the fans. They know this is a big chance here. Now they're going to alter things. Here's the substitution. And deciding to go short with this one. Sends it back. Tremendous block. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Chavalera. Marseille recovering possession well. Well, the away side haven't bossed the possession, as you can see. But when they have won it back in midfield areas, their counter-attacking has been excellent. They'll be happy with the way the game's going at the moment. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. 
It is a decent looking attack here. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Well, that pass easy on the eye, but not quite what was needed. I really thought they were going to open up the defence. Valentin Rongier. A foul, but advantage played. But it didn't end up being a significant advantage. And so a free kick here. No card, but the referee clearly stating that's the last warning. Time for a change then. Gerson well beating his opponent that's not a bad ball oh a moment of pure class had to catch it perfectly and didn't he just well here we can see it again look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself and the strike could not get any better he hits through the back of the ball with such power what a goal this is So 2-0 now. Five minutes to go. Illegal play and hence a free kick. And time for the change now. Abdel Hamid Mathieu Cafaro well that is how to run at defenders the end product just wasn't there can they hit on the break well as you can hear the fans think that should have been a penalty but I'm not convinced committed challenge And there goes the final whistle. It's gone the wrong way as far as the home fans are concerned. Well, Derek, they weren't at their best today, both as individuals and as a team. And they didn't deserve anything from the game. Need a much better display next time out.